Hey guys, we're going to be working on the song Slow Cheetah today by the Red Hot Chili Peppers. My personal favorite song of theirs, besides several other things. <laughs> um, one of my favorites. Uh, but this uh, riff, this is just the intro. This riff is a whole lot of finger picking. And uh, all it is is finger picking, and it's a real simple chords. It's not like anything really intricate. It's just a pretty straightforward uh, chord, so let's get started. I'm going to play it just in here. So that's how the opening goes to it. I'm not going to be working on any other parts of the song. It's a pretty, uh, a pretty long explanation just to start off with. Uh, so basically, what we're going to start doing is we're going to. Um, there's one picking motion that involves uh, these, your thumb and your first finger, and that is uh, you play the E string, then you play it with your thumb. The, the D string with your first finger, the uh, E string with your first, with your thumb, and then the the G string with your first uh, with your first finger again. So it's not all that, but that's just the main picking motion. So it's like. So there's some like shifting, but I'll uh, show you that later. So we start off with an E minor chord and also not to forget we have the capo on the sixth fret right now uh, standard tuning uh, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna start off with that same picking motion I was telling you uh, and with an E minor chord so you're gonna go open open um, E string second fret uh, second fret D string, open E string, and open G string. Then all you're gonna have to do for this one is put your first finger on uh, what is the ninth fret of the E string, and continue with the same picking pattern. Then you're gonna shift to a C chord, and which, if you don't know how to play C chord, you probably shouldn't be watching this video. Um, and what you're going to do with the same picking pattern is you're going to move this over. Actually, actually no, you're going to move. Sorry, you're moving to an A minor chord. And what you're going to do is you're going to shift your picking. Originally, how you were playing it was thumb A, A E string, first <laughs> finger. Uh, D string, thumb, E string, and then uh, first finger, G string. Well, what you're gonna do is you're gonna shift that pattern just down one string. So it'd be thumb, A string, first finger, G, uh, first finger, G string, then thumb, A string, then first finger, um, first finger, B string. So it's gonna go, and with an A minor chord, it's gonna sound like this. Then you're gonna go to the same pattern again, except you're just gonna switch to C. Then you're gonna go. Except instead of playing the instead of playing the B string, you're gonna play the open high E string. It's gonna sound. So it's gonna go like this. So you're gonna play that twice. Then you're gonna go, you're gonna play the open E string, open low E string. Then put your first finger on the eighth fret of the high E string. Then just play open high E string. Then you're gonna play ninth fret, uh, ninth fret low E string. Then 
eighth fret, uh, eighth fret B string. I mean, uh, uh, ninth fret B string, and then open B string. So it's gonna go. Then open A string. Then uh, eighth fret D string. I mean, eighth fret G string. Then open, uh, open uh, D string. Then you're gonna put your third or second finger uh, on. It doesn't really matter. Uh, on the ninth fret A string. Then you're gonna play uh, the what's this? The eighth fret D string. Then open D string. So it's gonna be. I like teach you another lesson. I haven't been doing this a lot lately, so that's all you got to do for the intro uh, right now. And uh, well, I'll have fun and keep on working. It takes you a little while to get it, but once you do, it sounds really good and impresses lots of people. And you know, anyway, uh, thanks for watching.